how's it going? Back with another one here. A Sunday morning. Nice bit of sunshine out there now. Can't look into it there, it's blinding me. But um, just doing a bit of a walk around in some of the fields up here in Sherwood. Just giving a look, see what the cover is like on them and see what it's looking like. Grass seems to be after growing good and well anyway. There's a nice little bit of cover on it. If we get a bit of dry weather now, we try to get out a bit of fertilizer. It's not looking like that for a few days anyway, but now we might get it. But nice grotty time there now at the minute. Grass is coming on well, good colour in it, and a nice little bit of cover. Um, the heifer calf there last night, just show you that calf there, and she calved easy enough. We're getting into the thick of it now, it is coming quick and fast. But everything's going so going fairly well, thank God, anyway. And no great hassle pulling an odd one, but not major pulls, just getting them started coming easy enough then after that lucky enough so it's hard to know what way they were probably a bit fatting themselves maybe um, it does be hard to know whether they're coming back too much they're coming back too much then and they won't have milk so it's catch 22 isn't it but anyway I'll show you just a bit around here and this is up here in Sherwood now in Carlo be, be hilly ground enough here now See behind me there now to be to be banky ground out that direction. And Mount Leinster now behind me, you probably won't see that well now with the, the sun glaring in over, but you have Mount Leinster up here. Black stairs is all along there. So we're up high enough. Anyway, we'll look a bit further. This is a field of multi-species that we did there last summer. We got a disc then June, that dry spell that was there, and it was broadcast then just with a, a small applicator, and um, that would have been done near the end of June, just as the weather was about to break. I seem to get a good hit enough anyway, but it's coming on well. I'm not sure whether it's ideal, but you can see that. Nice bit of clover coming through there. I'm not sure chicory and there's plantain in it as well. There's a couple of species of grass. But as you can see there's a nice cover of stuff on it. But there's the way forward or not, I'm not 100 percent We'll see now how it goes this year. Try it with no fertilizer. It's supposed to not need any fertilizer anyway, so we'll give it a try anyway and see how we get on with it. Silage, I don't know whether you can make silage from it or not, but I might try a small piece. But uh, the field is not really big enough anyway to, to be grazing it, as well as try to get a bit of silage off. We might try some, see what it's like. It seems, looks fairly good so far anyway. Oh, another field here, as you see there in the wheel tracks now, just there's a nice little bit of grass cover there. That'll be nearly fit to graze now if you could get a few fine days. I think it'll be fertilizer out as I was saying anyway, and sure, keep push it on now anyway. There's a nice little bit of cover on that there now, it's going well so. on well. Uh, these will be some of our bankier fields now. Nice bit of a brow on these here now. It doesn't really show it there that well in the camera but that's steep over there now. Nice bit of grass on it there too. Uh, these will be some of our bankier fields now. Nice bit of a brow on these here now. It'd be doesn't really show it there that well in the camera, but that's steep over there now. There's a nice bit of grass on it there too. Yeah. 
And the hip of calf lifter. A quicker than I thought. And that's it. I'll have her calf. She's not too bad. And little calf, give it a little bit of a help, but easy enough calved. I don't know, I have them a few years now, there's a good few heifers after coming after them now, so he's inclined to be a bit lame there on the hind leg as well, so he's for, for change and anyway. He's able to not too bad he comes right, but he gets lame then again he can he can get you over hobble now with it. He'll still serve a few and the new bull coming there now he'll be um ah should have him now in ten days or a fortnight anyway I'd say. I think he'll be a look at him when he comes as well now. He'll be out at the same place as the two bulls now. Gary Morris, you know, we're happy with the bulls that we're getting off him. Good breeding, good long cattle there as you can see in that lad now, just good size to the calves. He's bringing bring in good calves now. And the other fella as well, the other fella now will be bringing more shapey calves. Be more kill, better for the factory. This lad now will bring nice cows. Heifers will be good after him. They have milk with him as well, so we're happy with him as well. These now will be younger calves again. Something around. It's not really the oldest of them now, it's about. They're not a month old. And they are some softer calves in it as well. They're not that old. There's young calves in it there. That lad there now is only a couple of weeks. That'll be a heifer now after that bull I was just showing you there now. She's a nice little bit of an elder on her. She's showing up on that one too, like she's bringing. They should have a nice bit of milk on them. A good size of a heifer too. That one there now, like she's a good, good shape to her. Surely a, a you bred, a you bred heifer or cow now at this stage. Is that one the same? We find cows now in their time. This is the slatted shed we have here. Slatted there was say cubicles either side. These are cows still left to calve. This should be probably calving. One and one and a half should see them calved. There's two of them. They're later on. They won't be, we'll be calving until September or October time I'd say. They were late and we just held the bull away from him and just tried to bring him in with all them calvers then. But as you can see they don't all lie up in the cubicles. They could lie anywhere. But that's what we have here. So that lady there now I think she's making a bit of a spring in there as well. The bones are after falling on her there now, I'd say she'll calve. The next couple of days we'll see about bringing her over to the straw shed now anyway. It's a bit loose looking behind so. Yeah, the bones are down on her now so I'd say she should. Um, she's not far off. Other than that now I'd say she's the only one there now in the short term anyway. But you never know. Now, oh, I'm going to end the video here. Just have to finish and feeding these up and all. In the next one now, we'll be just uh, running these heifers through the through the scales there and we'll see how they are thriving, see how they're gaining and what have you. And there's a few I'd say I'll be picking out for the factory as well. Anyway, like and subscribe and give us a share if you, if you can. Get me out there a bit more. Good luck.